Dauleshwaram Barrage. This is an irrigation structure which is built in 1852 on the lower stretch of the Godavari River before it empties into the Bay of Bengal. The barrage was built by a British irrigation engineer, Sir Arthur Thomas Cotton. This barrage provides water for east and west Godavari districts for agriculture. The Dauleshwaram Barrage is 15 feet high and 3.5 kilometers long, with 175 crest gates to pass the floods. Before this barrage was constructed, many hectares of land has been flooded with water and was unused. The water would be worthlessly going into sea. But when Sir Arthur Thomas Cotton had built the barrage, those unused lands were brought into cultivation, and the water was stored and used. It was rebuilt in 1970 when it was officially renamed as Sir Arthur Cotton Barrage, and it was heightened up to 10.6 meters. The reservoir has 3.12 TMC feet cross storage capacity and depth storage of 2.02 TMC feet. Sir Arthur Cotton made the delta area of East Godavari as rice bowl of South India and he is known as the delta architect of Godavari district. The Cotton Museum was constructed on behalf of Cotton's memory which is now a tourist attraction in Rajmundry. This museum was inaugurated on the 21st of February 1988 by Sri Nandamuri Tarakarama Rao who was then the Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh. Cotton Museum was started with an intention to educate people about how Sir Arthur Cotton back in the day constructed the mighty Anicut across Godavari River and converted the lands of East and West Godavari districts fertile. The museum also narrates how the present cotton barrage was constructed with the advanced engineering technology. A lot of models collected from various places and projects are exhibited in this museum. The machinery of various types which were used at the time of construction of the old Anicut are also preserved and kept open for the viewers. Apparently, this is the only civil engineering museum established and maintained in the state of Andhra Pradesh.